once more i would like to welcome everyone being here so today our main objective of the session is to know about the organic chemistry main important questions we may not be able to cover all the questions but we will cover definitely those questions which can be expected in the examinations okay so let us start the session screen is yes, sir. yeah fine yes, sir. so uh, students we are going to start organic chemistry component is there how much marks isc uh, examination plus 2 what is the component of organic chemistry it's there on your screen but i want your response in the chat box so that we can count 31 is the marks that is required in the yeah okay so now next screen is uh, on your slide here you can see these are the chapters so hello alkane hello reens alcohol phenol ethers aldehyde ketones and carboxylic acid organic compounds containing nitrogen and biomolecules so these are the all the chapters which are there in organic chemistry okay so now my question to you is like it is it is not like that ki whatever i have written here that way only it will come i this is just just a supposition like approximately this weightage will be there it's not 100% this weightage will be there approximately we can say this much weightage is there hello alkane and hello reens four marks approximately alcohol phenol ether that would be five to six marks aldehyde ketone carboxylic acid five to seven marks organic compound containing nitrogen three marks so this three can increase to five also so you can see hello alkane and hello reens there are reactions which are related with amines so therefore 4 plus 3 7 so this way it can change some some uh, proportion of the marks can change here and there because some reactions are common so this you have to understand and keep in mind okay so now biomolecules maximum to maximum two marks paper is coming not more than that so please be careful for that if i tell five or six question the questions are coming from that only so there is no worry for that okay so let us uh, now everyone is clear that 31 marks paper is coming in the examination please uh, type yes y y or n so you can type in the chat box so that we can continue like organic chemistry how much marks paper is coming that is 31 is it clear everyone is clear about that how the components can be there how much marks will be there so please active in response so that we can continue okay so fine so that's good so now the next part is that what way we should prepare what way so you can see on your screen so uh, that the written is named reactions organic named reactions this how if i will say 31 marks how it will constitute i can mark it as a five marks for name reactions let us say let us see we can we can change also let us see five and conversion if i say three marks okay 538 testing also i can go for four 12 so 12 so if i will go for further now if i go for four marks conceptual and physical so 8 12 16 16 so now 16 and if i take four marks here so it will become 20 so still i am having something is missing something is missing so here chemical reaction is missing chemical reactions chemical reactions are missing directly 3 marks we can say that marks will be there so now total if you count 5 3 8 8 4 12 12 16 16 20 20 23 still if i say simply name reaction okay so to remember the reaction this name reaction so this can be asked in many number of ways all that i have included in name reactions that i want to say okay so for example mcq is coming convert let us say uh, convert benzene to acetophenol let us say this is the question benzene to acetophenol so it is it is a conversion okay and it is a name reaction also so that way i am taking it as the system okay so uh, chemical reaction means rmgx and uh, ammonia derivatives this is the main area okay ammonia derivative now so everyone is clear about this thing that uh, what what i am going to tell about name reactions conversion that in detail i will take up okay this we will take up detail just because until and unless you are not clear your vision your thinking is not as per the paper who is setting the paper so then you cannot score marks in organic so we have to plan it out what we need to study and what we can leave this is the session all about that okay so let us take up the first part name reactions okay 
So name reaction, if I will say, these are the name reaction which are most important name reactions. So you can even take the snapshot of that. Please, please, please don't. You cannot afford to leave these reactions. You can take the snapshot of this, uh, this slide. These are the name reactions which are asked very frequently by the ISC examination, by the ISC board. Right? Please take the snapshot. So now, when I talked about name reactions, name reaction can be asked directly. Maximum, maximum three marks they will ask directly. Don't expect that five marks simply they will ask because here I have written, I have written six marks here. So it does not mean that six name reaction they will ask directly. It's not like that. They will ask three name reaction directly, maximum to maximum. It can be two also. But six can come. How it can come, I will tell you now, right? So now this is clear to you. So if I will take up the next slide over here. If I take up the next slide here, let us say, okay, this. Now, this is the question to you. Actually, this is the open question to you. You can give the response. I will ask one by one. Okay. So, you have to match Friedel Craft reaction with any. You have to write the number only, nothing else. You have to write number. A will be related with which number? That's all. This is the matching type of question. Friedel Craft reaction is related with which number? You have to write the number in the chat box. It means your idea is clear. Friedel Craft reaction related with which number? Please write the in the chat box that number which you see feel that it can be matching. This is very Friedel Craft. I don't want all the responses. First, you tell about Friedel Craft. What would be the? It would be four. Yes, exactly. It's four. Exactly, exactly. Those who are writing four, it means that's clear. If you go for Williamson synthesis, what would be the number? Williamson synthesis. What would be the number? Now you go for Williamson synthesis. If everyone is participating, you will enjoy the session. Okay. Williamson synthesis. What would be the name reaction? What would be the conversion? We can say. Is it three? Yeah, it is three. Yes, ethyl chloride with toxic ethane. Ethers are produced. Very nice. Now, C, if you talk of aldol, what would be the name reaction? What would be the conversion? What number it represents? Yeah, please, please write in the chat box. I am able to see the chat box. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, anyone wants to speak something, you can speak. Okay. So, someone has raised the hand. You can speak because I am not able to see your, uh, we have to open that. Okay. If you want to speak, you can speak. No problem. Okay, Anmol, you can you can ask if any doubt is there with you. Yeah. Tell me. Okay, let us continue. So, uh, as I have seen the response from your side, you have written five reaction of steldehyde with dilute NOH. Absolutely right. Aldol condensation is related with dilute NOH. Absolutely right. Clemenson reduction. Next is Clemenson reduction. What would be the Clemenson reduction? What would be? What would be the number? Clemenson reduction. Yes, it's one. It's one. Absolutely right. What about Rosenmund? Rosenmund reaction or Rosenmund reduction? Rosenmund reduction. Rosenmund reduction. Your spelling is error. We can correct. Rosenmund reduction. What would be the answer? Six. Six is the right answer. Correct. What about HVZ? What would be HVZ? HVZ. Hell Wolhard Zielinski reaction. What would be the answer? Is it two? Absolutely right. So those students, those who have participated, they will be able to learn more. Whether they know one reaction or two reaction or three, this doesn't matter. Matter is whether we are willing to learn or not. So let us go ahead for the next part. Now you have to write the uh, that alphabets. So you have to write for aldol condensation. What would be alphabet? Al aldol condensation. What would be alphabet? For aldol condensation. What would be Elda? It's D. Yes, absolutely right. Fine. D is right. Can is arrow. What would be? Can is arrow. Can is arrow. What would be the alphabet? Can is arrow. D was for Eldol. What about can is arrow? Check, check, check. You can take your time and find out. 
यानी जीरो आई एम वेटिंग फॉर द रिस्पॉन्स कैन इज जीरो इज इट सी यस इट इज सी डिसप्रोपोर्शनेशन रिएक्शन कैन इज जीरो इज अ डिसप्रोपोर्शनेशन रिएक्शन विच मींस इट इज अ सेल्फ ऑक्सीडेशन एंड रिडक्शन रिएक्शन that same substance undergo oxidation same substance undergo reduction this is a very very important concept okay next is williamson synthesis we have done already what would be the answer williamson synthesis what alphabet 3 uh, sorry sorry benzoin first benzoin yeah benzoin what would be benzoin benzoin is benzoin is yeah alcoholic kcn with benzaldehyde benzaldehyde with alcoholic acl right answer fourth williamson synthesis what about williamson synthesis williamson synthesis williamson synthesis is related with h yes h is the right answer ethers are formed what about esterification what about esterification what about esterification Sterification is related with, yeah. Just let us see. H is related with ether. Ether is Williamson synthesis. What about the sterification? Five. Five sterification is related with what? Is it F? Yes, it is F. Eight. Eight means ester. Ethanol to ethyl ethanoate. Ester. Very good. Now, if you talk of uh, Riemer Riemer reaction, Riemer Riemer. Riemer Riemer reaction phenol to salicylaldehyde absolutely right absolutely right now haloform seven haloform haloform reaction what would be the answer haloform haloform is g g is yes chloroform and haloform both are similar okay correct last carbamine carbamine reaction carbamine reaction it is aniline to phenyl acid very nice you can clap for yourself that because these are the things if you are able to do that it means most of the things are under this on means if we have talked about these name reactions all these name reactions interrelatedly can be asked in this form which i have given to you means what is converted to what this should be clear to you what are the reactants what are the products what are the reagents what are the by products what are the temperature pressure conditions or ph conditions right these are things you should be aware okay so now now there is one more exercise for you so you one of you can unmute yourself and speak and tell me the answer so that i can save my time okay anjan uh, anjan ashwin can you do that yes sir okay. first one is so tell me first first which reaction it is first one it's pedo craft very good next second what would be this reaction ch3 ch2 br with ch3 o n a um williamson very nice next third blue canvach aldo aldo very good so this is what we can because we can save time in this manner fourth this one reaction ch3 ch2 with the h zinc mercury hcl So I think Clemenson. Yeah, absolutely right. Next, RCOCl plus hydrogen platinum barium sulfate silane. So that's a Rosenmund. Rosenmund reaction. So now here, why platinum? Platinum is the catalyst. Everyone is clear. Here, here sulfur sometimes is written. Sulfur here is missing. Sulfur is there. Why sulfur is there? Sulfur normally we are writing platinum barium sulfate sulfur silane. What is the role of sulfur over here? So I'm not sure, but in some cases they just add impurities. No, 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 no. It's not like that. We are adding because sulfur acts as poison. Because you know, acid reduction gives aldehyde. Aldehyde reduction gives alcohol. We want to stop at aldehyde. That's why sulfur poison is used, right? This is special role for that. Okay, so sulfur is used as a poison here. Now, okay. last this last reaction. What would be the name reaction? Chlorine red phosphorus. It's HVZ. HVZ. Hell, Walker, Zelinsky reaction. Very good. Okay, so now let us go with this reaction again. It is aldol. We know that second one. HCHO plus NaOH concentrated. So that's Canizaro. Canizaro reaction. 
So now I was talking about it is a disproportionation reaction. What is the meaning that? Now you know formaldehyde. If you go for reduction, formaldehyde, LDH reduction give alcohol, formaldehyde to methanol. This is reduction. Now formaldehyde oxidation it gives acid, formic acid. And when formic acid reacts with NaOH, it becomes HCONA. That is salt, acid plus base salt. So now formaldehyde undergo oxidation to formic acid or sodium formate and formaldehyde reduction reduced to give methanol. So a same substance when undergo oxidation and reduction that reaction is known as disproportionation reaction. So there are two reactions in organic chemistry which undergo disproportionation reaction. One is a formaldehyde with the Canizaro reaction and benzaldehyde Canizaro reaction. So this we have to keep in mind. This is the most expected question in the exam. Okay. So now this benzaldehyde plus KCN alcoholic, which reaction it is? Benzoic. Benzoic. It is very, very easy reaction. Just addition products are there. Aldol addition product is there and benzoin also addition product are there. Okay. So let us move to this part. What would be this reaction? First one, top one, ethoxy ethane is produced. Okay. It's Williamson synthesis, right? So next reaction, acid plus alcohol, dash plus water, acid plus alcohol. Dash so plus that's, uh, esterification. 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 So actually, esterification is an equilibrium reaction. There is equilibrium between the ester formation and the reactants. So now, how to prevent that? We are using concentrated sulfuric acid. Concentrated sulfuric acid uses a dehydrating agent. Now, water, as soon as it is produced, it will be taken away by concentrated sulfuric acid. As per leach earlier principle, reaction will move, go in forward. That's the role of concentrated sulfuric acid. We say it is a H2SO4 is a catalyst. So catalyst means to say that if you want to increase the reaction, increase the formation of the products like esters. So we need to have concentrated sulfuric acid, otherwise, the reaction will go in the backward direction. So that's the role of concentrated sulfuric acid over here. So now next next uh, like next reaction, what would be the name reaction? So Remertimo. So now if in this reaction, if I change CHCl3 with CCl4, what would be the answer? If I change CHCl3 with the CCl4, what would be the change in the product? It would be CHO will change into COOH. This will be the change. Means ortho we say that will become ortho salicylic acid. Okay. And instead of 4, 3 NaCl, it will become 4 NaCl and 3 water. So this would be the small change when you are changing the water. Is it clear now? Please confirm. All the students kindly confirm. Students as well as teachers also might be present. So, if I am uh, going in the right direction, please can, uh, put the, your yes there so that we can continue further. Because I want to just uh, take up, cover up more things. That's why I have to go with this speed. Okay. So, now this is the question. Who will give me the answer? Can anyone write in the chat box what would be the answer? During the course of SN1 reaction, intermediate species form. So, SN1, SN2 question is regarding to mechanism. I have not written any mechanism question here. Right. So, we can write a mechanism. Here we missed out mechanism. So that's the reason something if we missed here, here mix me mechanism. Mechanism also question can be asked, but not more than two marks. Maximum to maximum two marks. So I can reduce here five. I can reduce here four. Okay. So this is what the what will happen. Got it? So why I means missed some mechanism two marks maximum to maximum question can be asked. So now here what we will answer. Due to the formation of SN1, you know SN1 what is formed is uh, alkylide, it's forming C plus, C plus and the nucleophile will be separated. So this is formation of carboctyl. C plus means carboctyl. Okay. So 3 degree alkylide, this is a preferred product. 3 degree greater than 2 degree greater than 1 degree, then it's SN1 mechanism. If 1 degree greater than 2 degree greater than 3 degree, that is SN2 mechanism. Mostly this question will be expected if they are asking mechanism type of question. Mechanism type of question can be asked from esterification. Mechanism can be asked from dehydration of alcohol at concentrated 443 and 413 Kelvin and SN1 and SN2. And they can ask also the mechanism from the nucleophilic addition reaction of LDH and keto. These are the areas where probability is there. Mechanism type of question can be asked, but you need not to worry. Why? Because Either the question will come in the fill in the blanks or in the matching or maximum to maximum one mark question directly will be asked about the products formed. Means which will be the 
order of the product formation like i told you sn1 the product formation 3 degree alkyl like greater than 2 degree greater than 1 degree if you want to prepare 3 degree alkyl light, sn1 mechanism will follow for that so 1 degree sn2 will be followed so these are the small small points we need to just take care of okay so now so who will read this question first of all yes anyone else uh, who will read ashwin anjana um, please yes, can you read much. yeah um, an aromatic organic compound A on heating with ammonia and um, copper oxide at high pressure gives B. The compound B on treatment with ice cold solution of any NO2 and HCl gives C, which on heating with Cu, HCl gives compound A again. Identify the compounds A, B, and C. Write the name of the reaction for the conversion of B to C. Thank you. So here we can see that. One reaction is with ammonia and copper oxide. You can see the full organic chemistry book only and only this reaction is from alkyl halide. Alkyl means aryl, aryl halides. Now high pressure also there. High pressure means this is this reaction will not take place. It means aryl halides are less reactive than alkyl. This also question can be asked. So I have indirectly told you that this question is important. Aryl halides are less reactive than alkyl halides. Okay. So now compound B on treatment with ice cold solution. What reaction is there which ice cold solution is required? 0 to 5 degrees Celsius. Can anyone write in the chat box which reaction that is? Which name reaction? We have not mentioned their name reaction. Which reaction which is requiring ice cold solution? 0 to 5 degrees Celsius temperature. Which reaction that is? You can write in the chat box. So that we can come to know. Yeah, okay, this reaction was there. It is used here in this manner. Which reaction is there? Ice cold solution. Ice cold, 0 to 5. Either, either that reaction is, you are writing, I am waiting for your response. I am waiting for your response, you can tell. So, ice cold solution means, okay, ice cold solution means diazotization. Diazotization. Diazotization means aniline is converted to benzene disonium chloride. It means B is known to us. And C is also known to us. B is aniline and C is benzene disonium chloride. And you know about Sandmeyer and Gatterman reaction. Can anyone please tell copper HCl whether it is a Sandmeyer reaction or Gatterman reaction? Copper HCl whether it is Sandmeyer or Gatterman. Can anyone tell? Benzene disonium chloride is converted to chlorobenzene in the presence of CuHCl. What would it be? It is Sandmeyer or Gatterman? It's in the chapter, first chapter. Sir, it's Gatterman. Yeah, Gatterman. So, it means, they have asked this question. I have told you their back end, like I asked, I told this thing, that name reactions will be asked and five marks name reaction will be asked. So, you can very well interpret now, three reactions they can ask directly, but two reactions they will put the question in this manner. In this manner means, any manner. It can be of A, B, C type. It can be any other manner. So, two marks name reaction will be asked, but in the different way. It will not be asked directly. Because here, you can see B to C, it is a disorientation reaction. And C to A, it is a Gatterman reaction. So, two reactions they have asked in two marks. Along with that, they ask a few more things. That chlorobenzene is converted to aniline in the presence of ammonia and copper oxide. This reaction also they have asked. So answer is there on your screen. Is it clear to everyone? Please let us continue with the next question. The question is this question. Chlorobenzene treated with ammonia in the presence of copper oxide at 475 Kelvin and 60 atmosphere. See, see the same question which was there in the previous question they have asked in another manner in any other paper. So, mean to say, the sum answer is very, very easy. Chlorobenzene to aniline. Very easy answer. So, they have asked the similar question in this manner. Okay. Similarly, ethyl chloride is treated with alcoholic KOH. Anyone can tell me whether it will be ethyl alcohol or ethene? What would be the answer? Ethyl chloride is treated with alcoholic potassium hydroxide. Whether it will be alkene or alcohol? This thing only you have to tell me. Firstly, you can tell in the chat box. So, that I can continue. Ethyl chloride, whether it alcoholic KOH is there, whether alcohol or alkene, it will be alkene. Absolutely right answer. So you can see on the screen. So this is the answer. 
this answer says that it is forming alkene okay fine this please remember please read sets of rule very very important in point in the point of asking the, the board question they can ask sets of rule okay during the hydrohalogenation of alkyl light the preferred product is that which is more substitute that question can be asked okay now if it is aqueous it will be forming alcohol please do remember this also now can you tell me the answer for this question bleaching powder on treatment with ethanol or acetone gives dash it is an example of dash reaction bleaching powder only one reaction only chloroform yes absolutely i want this quick answer so that we can continue okay so uh, i will not be able to continue more than 20 minutes now so please uh, just uh, you have to fastly respond whether with the, through the voice as well as through the chat box okay let us go with the next question on heating with aliphatic primary mean with the chloroform and alcoholic potassium hydroxide the organic compound formed is what do we form you can speak the answer so it can be fast Al aliphatic primary mean with the chloroform what would be the answer so isocyanide yeah, yeah absolutely alkyl isocyanide very good very nice so let us go with the next question chlorobenzene to biphenyl which name reaction it is chlorobenzene to biphenyl which name reaction chlorobenzene to biphenyl which name reaction it is chlorobenzene to biphenyl i can give you a hint alkyl halide fitic yes fitic absolutely right now propene to one bromopropane whether marconic of rule or anti marconic of rule propene to one bromopropane whether marconic or anti marconic anti marconic yes chlorobenzene to aniline chlorobenzene to aniline how to prepare chlorobenzene just now the same reaction please see the same reaction which has been asked nearly two to three times so you this reaction is important it means we have to be careful for that very clear those reactions which are coming frequently how we can afford to leave that right let us go to the next question phenol and nitrobenzene are treated separately with concentrated sulfuric acid and concentrated nitric acid what would be the difference what would be the difference in the products what would be the difference in the products so answer i am telling you then i will explain so see phenol phenol when treated with phenol when treated with the nitric acid the one reaction was there 2 4 6 trinitrophenol that everyone is knowing it's easy reaction that's also known as picric acid so now second question they ask if you see nitrobenzene sulfuric acid phenol with the phenol and nitrobenzene mean second question was nitrobenzene so nitrobenzene nitro group is ortho para directing or meta directing can anyone please tell nitrobenzene is ortho para or meta please type or you can speak nitrobenzene is which directing group ortho para or meta ortho para no 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 nitro group is meta directing always remember one tip i am going to give you whichever the group that attached to the benzene ring if it is containing double bond it would be meta directing nitro if you open the structure of no2 n double bond o and n forming o coordinate bond this is there so it means nitro is having double bond now if you take benzaldehyde c double bond o h it will be a meta directing group now if you take benzoic acid c double bond o oh so it is having double bond it will be meta directing now if you take cyanide c triple bond n it will be meta directing if you take so3h that also meta directing so the conclusion from this talk is the group which is attached to the benzene ring if it is containing double bond it will be meta directing if it is containing single bond like phenol toluene chlorobenzene phenol so these are all or any sol och3 group so these are ortho para direct so very clearly i have told so this you have to keep in mind ortho para and meta now this question acetaldehyde to acetaldehyde to propane to ortho now this question can you tell me how many carbon is there in acetaldehyde it is aldehyde to carbon aldehyde acetaldehyde and propane no it means this is the reaction which is leading to conversions so i have told you previously i have shown you the slide that conversions if you see if i have uh, told already this component i have told you conversions here 
So I told you four mark conversion will be asked. So when the question is asked, convert chlorobenzene to aniline, that was also conversion. Now question was asked is acetaldehyde to two propanol, that is also conversion. So please keep in mind how the questions are being asked. So when you know how the questions are asked, it would be easy for us to answer. Okay. So let us come to the question which was asked. This was a question acetaldehyde to propane to all. This is the question where carbon we need to increase. There are two routes by which carbon we can increase apart from Woods reaction. Woods I am not taking. First route is RMGX route and second route is KCN. Third if you want to take you can take Woods reaction but normally Woods reaction questions you can avoid that was a plus one worth catching. Okay. So now this is the question Grignard region. Please, please, please everyone. I am telling three times please I have spoken. For this Grignard region is very, very crucial. Always one question from Grignard region is coming. Please remember, very simple. I can tell you in tips. For maldehyde reaction with Grignard region, one degree alcohol. Aldehyde reaction with Grignard region, two degree alcohol. Ketone reaction with Grignard region, three degree alcohol. These are the three reactions separate. Now, RMGX reaction with RMGX itself is a Grignard region only, um, organometallic. RMGX plus water alkane. It is not, not being asked usually. Okay, so no need to worry. Now, second reaction is carbon dioxide with RMGX acid, one carbon extra. Now, HCN with RMGX aldehyde, one carbon extra. RCN with RMGX ketone with one carbon extra. So, these at least five reactions you should remember. So, for, for again, formaldehyde with RMGX 1 degree alcohol, aldehyde with RMGX 2 degree, ketone with RMGX 3 degree. These are the three reactions. Fourth, carbon dioxide plus RMGX acid. Five, fifth, fifth is what? HCN. HCN with RMGX aldehyde. RCN with RMGX ketone. So, these are the reactions 3 plus 4 and uh, 2, 6. Sixth reaction, very, very important. It all comes under ascent of series. Ascent means increasing the number of carbon. So here RMGX reactions are used. Now let us move to the next question. This question is related to physical properties. I, if you see, if I will show you again the slides which I have told already the how the marks are being asked, the question the being asked. If you see, please see this question, this again. Name reaction. So some idea you got to clearance like how name reactions are asked. Two, three name reaction directly they will ask. Two by conversion route and all that. Convergence. So, you know, come to know how convergence questions will be asked. Testing. Conceptual question. Now, what question? Now it was written. It was related with conceptual. Finding ABC also you have gone through. RMGX ammonia. I have just given you the first hint for RMGX. Okay. Ammonia derivative. Aldehyde ketone chapter full is there. Ammonia and ammonia derivative like reaction with NH2H. Reaction with hydrogen. Reaction with 2,4-DNP. So, these are all ammonia and ammonia derivatives. Then mechanism. Okay. So, some idea I think you have now got it what I want to say. Okay. So now, so let us come to that question which we left. Uh, okay. So here, why do alcohol possess higher boiling point as compared to those of corresponding alkanes? Alcohol having higher boiling point, of course everything, everyone knows that this is due to intermolecular hydrogen. Some students, they used to write hydrogen bonding. It is incorrect to write hydrogen bonding because hydrogen bonding are of two types, inter and intra. So you need to define that whether it's inter or intra. So you should write it is due to intermolecular hydrogen bonding, not only hydrogen bonding. Please be careful for that. Okay. So now the one concept is that whenever you are writing this type of answer, you should compare both things, not simply closing. It is due to intermolecular hydrogen bonding. It's not. It is not complete answer. We should write because alcohol is having OH and OH because hydrogen bonding condition is there. Small. Electron active element, small size and hydrogen present. Three are conditions are there. So, these three conditions should be met. Now, alkane are not having oxygen. Electron active element is not there. That's why it's not forming hydrogen bonding. So, you need to compare alcohol forming by and alkane not forming by. So, this thing should be clear if we are targeting 100 marks. 100 marks only will come when you justify, when you, when you explain the answers properly. Okay. Now, let us come to the next question. Ethyl alcohol to secondary. Now you see here ethyl alcohol contains how many carbon? Oh, who will tell? Yeah, one person can tell so that we can continue. 
properly. You can speak so that better. Um, anyone can unmute and tell. Thylal alcohol contain how many carbon? Two carbon. Okay. And propyl? Propyl alcohol? Propyl alcohol? Three. So now it means it is a ascent of series question. Now I have told you Grignard region for fundamental. I told you formaldehyde with RMGX give one degree and aldehyde with RMGX give two degree. This only told. So now if you convert this ethyl alcohol, ethyl alcohol to aldehyde and aldehyde plus RMGX, you got your answer. I want to repeat once more. If if you are converting, if you are converting, for example, let us say C two H five O H. If I am converting this into CH three CHO, and if I am writing the reaction with CH three MgBr, what you are going to get? What you are going to get? You are going to get CH three CH OH and CH three means two propanol. Is it okay to everyone? So because we need to write properly and not written properly, so we have to write oxidizing agent and O we have to write nascent oxygen. With the PCC, PCC we should write not KMnO4. PCC only we have to use PH2Cl2. Why we are using PCC only? Why not KMnO4? If you use KMnO4, it will oxidize to acid. We want to stop at aldehyde. That's why PCC is used. So please be careful for that also. Okay. C2H5OH oxidation through PCC. It will be forming aldehyde. Aldehyde will Grignard region with dry ether. It will give us the two degree alcohol. Secondary alcohol. Secondary we say is in common name, and two degree means two propanol we say in IUPAC. Is it clear to everyone? Shall we go ahead with the next question? Anji, please. Shall we go ahead? Is it okay? Or still doubts are there in this? Fine. Let us continue with the next part. This question. So now I told you the some word was used there. Physical property and conceptual question. Physical property conceptual question means physical property means isomers. Also comes under physical area only, conceptual question only. So they ask isomer question. That can be possible. Very simple. This question is there. You can very well say C two H six O. It is alcohol and ether. That's all. Very simple. And second is reaction of ether with PCl five. That's all. So this is the very simple. I feel you can do that. This was the there ethers C two H five O H and C H three O C H three. This was the reaction. Very very easy reactions. Nothing is there in that. Okay, is it okay now? Shall we continue with the next part? Very simple reaction. These are. Is it okay? Yeah. Okay. Next. Now this question came. Methyl magnesium bromide. Can you please tell that which is that methyl magnesium bromide? It is it. It's the same RMGX. No, I told you we cannot leave RMGX. RMGX with water, RMGX with alcohol, they are producing only alkane. So it means ethyl alcohol will be changed into alkane. So means ethane will be formed. Oh sorry, methane, methyl, methyl. Sorry, sorry. RMGX, RH will be formed. RH, RH means RCl3H methane. Okay. So if you are adding water, the same reaction it would be CH4. Yes. Because here this is the reaction which represent acidic nature of alcohol, where H is breaking, OH bond is getting detached, and H is connecting with CH3. This is the mechanism. Okay. Now, now can you tell this answer? No pen to all on treatment with iodine and sodium hydroxide gives dash precipitate, and the reaction is called as dash test. Who will tell? Very simple. Very important. Question will be asked in finally again also this time also is possible. I don't know. Yeah, which precipitate color? Precipitate color. Which one? Yellow. Yellow precipitate. Okay. Fine. Now please, please, please remember when I have talked of here in this uh, when I start the session, we told you that this questions will be coming in this manner. I am repeating you again and again. Why? Why? Because I am correlating all these things. Name reaction. I have told you three directly. They will ask two. They will ask in the conversion form or ABC form. Conversion. They will ask directly or indirectly. This we have done conversion only. No ascent of series. Propen to all ethanol to this. Right. Testing. No testing was not touched. 
This is the question of testing. Two times idoform test question was asked. This is nothing but idoform test. Please remember, idoform test is the most important question. You cannot afford to leave that question. You have to be mastered in the idoform test. Okay, fine. RMGX questions are being asked regularly. So this you can see also here. RMGX question they have asked. RMGX plus water also they can ask. RMGX plus alcohol they can ask. RMGX plus formaldehyde they can ask. RMGX with aldehyde they can ask. RMGX plus ketone they can ask. RMGX plus carbon dioxide they can ask. RMGX plus HCN they can ask. RMGX plus RCN they can ask. You should be very thorough with all these reactions of RMGX. Two reactions only will come. Two to three, not more than that. But we need to work out on this. Okay. Let us come back to that question where we stopped. Okay. So this was the question. Uh, this we have done. This also I think it's covered. Dehydration. I told you mechanism question they were asking. This is a mechanism question, and I told you two marks can maximum to maximum two marks question or either one mark only. They have not asked any time more than two marks question from mechanism. Dehydration of alcohol to alkene by heating with concentration. You guess it. Initiation step is what? Can anyone tell? Which is the initiation step in the mechanism of dehydration of alcohol? Initiation. How this initiation takes place? Initiation alcohol is starting from word P. Protonation. Yes, absolutely right. Protonation of alcohol molecule. Very good. Now let us go for the next question. So previously also this question was asked. Phenol to phenol with reacted with concentrated nitric acid. Now again same picric acid from phenol. So same question, nothing more than nothing less. Ethyl chloride from diethyl ether. This was similarly asked ether plus PCl5. The same reaction they have asked now again. So I don't want to waste your time here. The same thing is there. It's one and the same thing whether you react with PCl5 or SOCl2, both answers are acceptable. Okay, so this is simple only. I don't want to waste time next. Next we do. Okay, this question. Any sulfuron phenol. Which reaction? Which name reaction is discussed over here? This is nothing but Williamson synthesis. Williamson synthesis. So the question I told you earlier, the name reactions they may ask in this manner also. Similarly, ethyl acetate from ethanol. Can you write which name reaction it is discussion of? Which name reaction is discussed here? Ethanol to ethyl acetate. Can anyone tell? It is a eight. I earlier pointed out eight. Which name reaction it is? Esterification. Esterification. Yes, ethanol. Plus ethanoic acid give rise to ethyl acetate. Ethyl acetate is common name. Ethyl ethanoate. Ethanol plus ethanoic acid. Okay, so this is the reaction. Fine. So they have given three multiple answer means any answer we can accept. But please remember we need to write considered sulfuric acid. Otherwise the reaction is equilibrium. Equilibrium is there. Okay. So now, in, if you talk of Williamson synthesis, Williamson synthesis only thing is they have they, this this here is not react correctly written. ONA bond bond should be there. So here bonding is missing because of bonding error. So so this way we have to do base base is NH base plus phenol acid Sa plus base salt and then again for the Williamson synthesis reaction is applied. Now can you tell this question? This is a question on testing. I told you. Testing five mark question will be there. So this way, some question they will put on idoform test. Some question they will put on which is this test? Which test? Lucas. Lucas test. They can ask questions on Lucas. They can ask distinguish between one degree alcohol and two degree alcohol. They can ask distinguish between two degree alcohol and three degree alcohol. They can ask distinguish between ethanol and propanol. Which test will be used if they are asking ethanol distinguish between ethanol and propanol? Can anyone tell? Which test will be used? Ethanol and propanol. One propanol, not two. Which test will be used to distinguish between ethanol and propanol? Hurry up, hurry up. It's idoform test. Ethanol will give idoform test. Okay, propanol will not. Right? So the answer for this question was Lucas region. And Lucas region, the reactivity order is 3 degree alcohol greater than 2 degree greater than 1 degree. Now I will like to ask one more question. Lucas test, which bond is 
डिटैचिंग विच बॉन्ड आर ओ एच बॉन्ड और ओ एच बॉन्ड विच बॉन्ड वी आर ब्रेकिंग आर ओ एच बॉन्ड विच बॉन्ड यू आर ब्रेकिंग इन लुकस टेस्ट आर ओ एच बॉन्ड और आर ओ एच बॉन्ड मीन ओ एच बॉन्ड और आर ओ एच बॉन्ड कैन एनी वन प्लीज टेल विच बॉन्ड दैट इज गेटिंग डिटैच आर ओ एच बॉन्ड और आर ओ एच ओ एच बॉन्ड और आर ओ एच कैन एनी वन प्लीज टेल यू शुड टेल फास्टली आई एम इन दिस दिस टेकिंग सेशन दे आर स्पीकिंग वेरी फास्ट आंसर आर ओ एच आर ओ एच बॉन्ड करेक्ट सो आर एच बॉन्ड इज गेटिंग डिटैच सो इट मीन्स this is nothing related with acidity it is related with basicity oh bond is getting broken so if the question is asked what is the acidic character acid character it is easy the bond between roh break, breaking of roh bond is very easy it means 3 degree is least acidic so please keep in mind all these things it is opposite to lucas test lucas test give 3 degree greater than 2 degree greater than 1 degree but if you talk of uh, if you talk of uh, Uh, acidic character of alcohol it is just reverse of that 1 degree greater than 2 degree greater than 3 degree please keep in mind this is a very important point you need to remember okay now next question conversions conversions linked with the name reactions benzene from phenol benzene from phenol it is simple dephenolation dephenolation reaction second i ethanol to iodoform this is nothing but iodoform test phenol to salicylaldehyde this is nothing but reamer treman reaction propanol to ol from grignard reagent ch3mgbr plus ch3cho these are the questions we have covered in the previous discussion 20 minutes back is it okay or what you are feeling that okay yeah, yeah this is not nothing much but it is coming same again and again is it not like that my dear students these all these questions are already there in the exam none of the questions which i have discussed is not from outside the questions from the board all the questions which i have put on the slide here these all are the part of the previous year questions so you need to understand the questions you need to understand the concept the way of asking may be different but question concept basic fundamental will be same always same reamer teman they may ask they may ask we not do sorry sorry they may ask convert ethanol to ethyl acetate they may ask a stratification they may ask phenol to any sol they may ask williamson synthesis right they may ask put to in acetaldehyde to put to in and they may ask aldol so this is the point you need to do so we need to first and the foremost thing we need to do all the name reaction we should practice thoroughly thoroughly means you should know about the name of the reactant whether common name or i p s name both you should know about the reagents you should know about the byproducts minimum and minimum you should some students say sir, sir organic compound i organic chemistry i cannot do so yaar what is the b is a very easy to get the marks in organic simple something you need to work on some one or two i think one previously i have made one more video also on organic chemistry you can go for that i think you will be beneficial let us move to the next question so benzene so these are the questions i think you will be able to do so i don't need to waste time here Now next question is this. acetone is treated with the Grignard reagent followed by hydrolysis. Again discussion there. Grignard reagent with ketone. Which degree alcohol? Grignard reagent with ketone. Can you please tell the answer? Grignard reagent with ketone. Ketone is acetone is ketone only. Which degree alcohol will be formed? Four carbon alcohol will be formed. Three is with acetone and one with RMGX. Which degree alcohol will be formed? Which degree alcohol will be formed? It's three degree. Okay, three degree. Are you told no? For valide. With RMGX one degree, acetaldehyde with RMGX two degree, ketone with RMGX three degree. That's all. Okay. So some of the questions are there. Phenol is treated with ice cold solution. Can you tell? Phenol is treated with ice cold solution. What would be this reaction? We are not done. This reaction is very important. It is azo di test. It is azo di test. Para hydroxy azo benzene is formed. Orange di. Okay. It is a coupling reaction. It is a coupling reaction, but asked in this manner. Diethyl ether is treated with phosphorus pentachloride. We previously also done the same question. 
okay so i feel this is uh, same so you can see so please one thing i would like to tell you this reaction coupling coupling is a reaction between benzene dizonium right for example this question is there i have told you either nitrogen based compound and alkyl light right? there is a shift of marks this is the reason for the shift because benzene dizonium chloride reaction are here also there also so that's why both way can be asked okay benzene dizonium chloride with the phenol phenol is acidic in nature can you tell me which is more acidic phenol or alcohol which is more acidic alcohol or phenol can you please type or speak fastly which is more acidic phenol or alcohol 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 is more acidic no no phenol is more acidic phenol is more acidic alcohol is less because phenoxide form is resonance stabilized phenoxide form is resonance stabilized but alkoxide is not resonance stabilized this is one of the reason for the resonance is there you have to draw and tell so phenol is more acidic so phenol if it is acidic the ph will be alkaline in this reaction please remember that this reaction of coupling ph will be 9 to 10 or 8 to 10 and if it is aniline in place of phenol aniline is a base then ph will be 3 to 4 acidic so this is the the clause we need to keep in mind and 0 to 5 degree is must for these reaction otherwise reaction will not take place and if you forget in 0 to 5 and uh, the whoever is an invigilator or is checking the your answer scripts they will not give the marks okay? they will also forget the marks if you have for, forget 0 to 5 degree celsius <laughs> okay so please keep in mind so uh, these were the reactions i scored it's already now 530 we started at 430 so i would like to sum up uh, with the some of the summary which I have taken up from the starting because all the things I told you in the very beginning you cannot be covered all the things but we will cover something which is very important to you so as previously coming back to the slide halal came four marks it can be five because it can be interchange no nitrogen compounds can be interchange here and there so you can see seven marks component alkylide and nitrogen containing compounds okay maybe eight also Alcohol phenol 3 third, approximately 5, 5 marks, 5 marks only, 6 also not 5. LDH ketone 7, 7 can be there. So if you see 4, 3, 7, 7 plus 5, 12, less 12 plus 7, 19, 19 plus 2, 21. So I was telling you biomolecules. Biomolecules me kya karna? Very simple. Reducing sugar, non reducing sugar. Sweet sugar, non sweet sugar. Okay. Then uh, that question of uh, uh, like uh, uh, this one, glucose and uh, glucose and sucrose the distinguish between glucose and sucrose okay this question bromine water test okay how sacric acid is produced that's one okay then afterward we are going to the proteins what are what are amino acids what is peptide linkage what is glycosidic glycosidic linkage in the in the this one carbohydrates and what is peptide linkage in the proteins these two things are very important now uh, further to that Isoelectric point in and carbohydrate, no sorry, uh, proteins. Isoelectric point in, uh, it is not point, it is pH. Please remember, it is pH. There is no net migration of uh, ion. Okay, and it acts as it acts as an internal salt or mixture because there is a jutrine. Okay, so jutrine question is there in amines also very important, and jutrine question is there in biomolecules also sulfonylic acid. Please keep in mind those. Okay, then afterward we are having vitamins. So this time you are lucky that vitamins are there. So one question from vitamin is expected. So you cover up the uh, vitamins, uh, not the uh, not the name means the sources and the, the the deficiency disease that part you have covered. Okay. So apart from that, difference between uh, DNA and RNA very very important, very 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 important. And essential amino acids and non-essential amino acids. Okay. And uh, no sorry. Uh, and water soluble uh, vitamins and uh, fat soluble that one so okay what do you have written okay, just one minute so what about the structure of dicycle better structure they are not asking but you just do the this question reaction with the bromine water reaction with the tolerance region of glucose open structure that is required structure no need to bother they are not asked they are asking from the point of view of chemistry not in the View of otherwise the structure of uh, DNA also there, so they that is they will not be asking. Mostly they are not. They have never asked. They have never asked. Okay, but if you want to do anything, anything, you please do only glucose close structure one one glucose structure, and you should know about the glycosidic linkage how it is formed. That much only, nothing else. Okay, 
otherwise mostly they will not ask that also okay now let us come to the part back now uh, this this is slide was also very important so i told you name reactions they directly they will ask two three name reaction and two reaction in the form of conversion or testing or something like that because testing why i told you carbamine is a test idoform is a test that's why i told you idoform and haloform reaction are same therefore testing also can be interrelated conversions rmgx based conversion high ascent of series descent of series i have not taken up the question hoffman bromide degradation very 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 important name reaction and conversion always one conversion based on hoffman bromide degradation will be there because we could not able to cover we could able to reach up to alcohol only actually we are not touch aldehyde ketone we are not touch carboxylic acid we are not touch amines right cyanide isosceles and we are not touched so only that portion only we covered which was there in the start okay so that's why those reaction not further finding abc one question we did more question marks are expected from that two marks question can be expected from this chemical reactions means reaction of aldehyde and ketone with ammonia and ammonia derivative so this type of questions okay so these are the questions which can be asked like for example alkylide with aqueous qh alkylide with the alcoholic qh right uh, alcohol with concentrated sulfuric acid 413 kelvin alcohol with concentrated sulfuric acid 413 443 these two reactions so these are some of the reactions which can be asked apart from that there are few reaction 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 with pcl5 alcohol reaction pcl5 benzoic acid reaction with pcl5 okay benzaldehyde reaction with pcl5 these are important reactions so some of the reactions are very very important hoffman bromide degradation i am telling you again and again acylation shorten bromine reaction very very important so these are some of the reactions which are, which are very very important apart from the test testing we have not touched about testing we just touched only this uh, uh, idoform test and lucas test look this is not sufficient enough five mark testing i have told you so testing the full session is required 40 minutes 40 minutes session is required only for testing and mechanism you need not to worry much either alcohol mechanism you can just see nucleophilic addition reaction mechanism you can see in aldehyde ketone and see sn1 sn2 that's all no more than that they will ask okay so uh, so any question you are free to ask now so it's already 35 and this is my app if you can just scan it and if you find it good you can just give your reviews also and uh, some tests you can do practice so any test further also you will take up so it will be helpful for you okay so any question so you are free to ask or any doubt is there in your mind in any question you want to ask you can unmute yourself and speak one by one yes any other question if you want to ask doubt is there otherwise thank you to everyone i am uh, means you are free